Math in the real world. Calculating tips. Here's a math hack. Let's say you went to Mama's Pizza with some friends and you ordered a large cheese pizza, a family salad, some garlic bread, and some sparkling water. And the subtotal was $30. And the sales tax in this part of the state is 8%. An 8% sales tax on $30 would be $2.40, making the total $32.40. Imagine a rating system where you rate the service of the restaurant. The lowest rating would be 0 to represent poor service, and the highest would be 30, representing excellent service. This rating system can represent the percent for the tip, and would include 0, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. When you calculate a tip, tip the subtotal, not the tax. Start calculating the tip by taking 10% of the subtotal. 10% of 30 is 3. Going back to the rating scale and the percent for the tip, we can put $3 for a 10% tip. Double that and we can put $6 for a 20% tip. And triple that and we can put $9 for a 30% tip. A 5% tip is halfway between 0 and 10, so the dollar amount would be halfway between 0 and $3. A 5% tip would be $1.50. Add $1.50 to $3, and you'd have $4.50 representing a 15% tip. Add $1.50 to $6, and you'd have $7.50 representing a 25% tip. Once again, a 10% tip for a $30 subtotal is $3, a 20% tip would be $6, and a 30% tip would be $9. A 5% tip would be half of a 10% tip, or $1.50. A 15% tip would be $4.50, and a 25% tip would be $7.50. Since you're satisfied with the service, you decide to make a 20% tip. 10% of $30 is 3 and 20% of $30 is 6, so you're going to make a $6 tip. In my city, I can quickly calculate a 16% tip by doubling the 8% sales tax. The tax on this bill is $2.40, so if I double $2.40, I'll have a $4.80 tip, which is a 16% tip, and I usually round that up to an even $5. You try it. Tip 10% on a $60 dinner bill. Ten percent of sixty dollars is six dollars. Try again. Tip twenty percent on a sixty dollar dinner bill. Twenty percent of sixty dollars is twelve dollars. This time try doubling the tax to calculate the tip. The tax is four dollars and twenty three cents. Four dollars and twenty three cents times two is eight dollars and forty six cents. Central Park is an urban park in New York City, located between the Upper West and Upper East Sides of Manhattan. It is the fifth largest park in New York City. Suppose you paid $130 for a carriage ride around Central Park. You really enjoyed the ride and the service, so you decided to give a 20% tip. What would the dollar amount of the tip be? Ten percent of hundred thirty dollars is thirteen dollars, so twenty percent is twenty six dollars. Something to memorize. Find ten percent of a number and you can easily find five percent and twenty percent of the same number. Let's use sixty two as an example. Ten percent of sixty two is six point two. Five percent is half of ten, so what's half of six point two? Half of 6 is 3, don't forget the decimal, 
and half of 2 is 1. So 5% of 62 is 3.1. 20% is double the size of 10%. So 6 times 2 is 12. Don't forget the decimal. And 2 times 2 is 4. 20% of 62 is 12.4. If these were 5%, 10%, and 20% tips for $62, they'd be $3.10, $6.20, and $12.40. Let's apply what we learned. You're a server in this restaurant, and you're responsible for these four tables. The subtotals for the bills are $120, $80, $62, and $142. The party at this table tipped 20%. The party at this table tipped 25%. The party at this table tipped 10%. And the party at this table also tipped 20%. How much money did each table tip? Press pause to calculate the tips. Twenty percent of $120 is $24. 25% of $80 is $20. 10% of $62 is $6.20. And 20% of $142 is $28.40. Thanks for watching this episode of Math in the Real World. Please like, share, and subscribe.